Alright, so I'm going to be giving a eulogy about my friend Fogel that I'll give at her funeral as if she had passed away. Alright y'all, I'm here to say a few words about my dear friend Anne Fogel Jones. Fogel was the funniest, most charismatic person I've ever met in my life. She might have been a bit mentally and emotionally unstable at times, but that didn't stop her from being the greatest legend I've ever known. I really just can't believe she's gone. Sometimes I can feel her presence surrounding me, like she's standing right next to me. And I can even hear her talking to me every once in a while. Now, Vogel was born and raised in a town called Calhoun in the great state of Georgia. While she didn't have a country accent, Fogel had enough crazy redneck stories about her friends and family from back home that you seriously just couldn't make up. Whether it was her car ride with a meth addict or her friend's spa birthday party in a random lady's barn that ended with a Bible study, she could always make you laugh while simultaneously being very concerned for her safety. While she was the constant comedic relief that I always needed, she also provided a great shoulder to cry on but she would usually end up crying too. We had such a special bond that it didn't matter if we were laughing so hard we fell on the ground or sobbing so hard that we threw up. No matter what, she always had my back. I mean, she's the one who came and found me when I was crying in a dark corner alone at the frat lots and the one who found me asleep in my car at 2 a.m. listening to sad music. Fogel was 1000% the best friend anyone could ever have. Now I know everyone else here has their own special Fogel memories, so I'll wrap this up, but I wanna to touch on one more thing that was super important to her. One of Fogel's greatest accomplishments was being a guest star on her good friend, Kobe Anderson's podcast titled Coke in the Closet. Fogel loved being able to share her friendship with Kobe, who is another comedic legend, through this platform, and I know that everyone who listened to it was able to see the light that she brought to her friends' lives every single day. Fogel was one of my most genuine and intentional friends, and I just cannot believe that she's really gone. Rest in peace, Fogel. Thank you.